Hello loves, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna keep this video very, very candid. There should not be any editing at all whatsoever because this is an update to my lap band. I am week 115 about, so I'm over the two year mark of having my lap band. For those of you that are tuning in just now or you're just coming to my channel and you're new to my channel, welcome. I do beauty and I also do updates on my bariatric surgery. So a little bit about me um, with the band. I have a 10 cc allergen band and the last time, uh, because I just recently had a little bit of an unfill, which I'll get to afterwards, the last numbers I had or the last amount I had in my band was 6.25 cc's in my band. So it was pretty substantial for having a 10 cc band and it, I thought it was right where it should be. That's why I haven't gotten a fill or an unfill. Now I haven't been too compliant with my um, medical aspects. I mean like following up every month and stuff like that because I didn't feel like I had a problem um, as far as the band goes. And I know that I was gaining weight so I didn't wanna go. <laughs> um, so I finally went about a month and a half ago and I followed up and I found out that my APRN that used to take care of me is no longer there. So now I have to deal with someone else in the practice. She's been there just as long, but I prefer the man that I had. His name is Pete and he was awesome and he's gone. So I'm not too happy about that. But anyway. Anyway, um, I'll try to talk over this. So anyway, I went, got some blood work done. I'm telling her I'm frustrated, you know, I'm gaining weight. I know that I'm not eating the right things. I know I'm not taking my vitamins, so I knew I was gonna be some sort of deficiency somewhere. So long story short, I got my blood work back last week. Um, my B12 is a, not where she wants it to be. It is fine, but it, she wants it higher. So she wants me to take B12. Um, she wants me to take vitamin A vitamin D and calcium, which I know I have to do anyway. And I have to take start taking my multivitamins, which if you guys have seen my other video, for those of you that have been here a while, know that I just cannot do the multivitamins. They're gross. But I will be trying out some of the like swallowable, the ones you can swallow. That didn't sound right. Um, <laughs> so I went to see her and I've gained weight. I have gained weight. I've actually maintained from the last time that I gained and then I gained like six pounds, which is so aggravating but whatever. I do go for the sweets and the crunchy foods when I get stuck. That's my problem. That's something I have to deal with and I'm trying to work on it. So anyway, um, I am actually considering getting a sleeve revision because I feel hungry. Even with my band being tight um, at that point, not tight, but it was like perfect for me. Um, I'm starving. I can eat, I can PB, which means productive burp or when you bring up your food and I feel like I can literally eat like maybe after two minutes of letting my stomach rest. I'm hungry. I want to eat. I'm going to eat it. Like it was so bad and it still is. Um, I got an unfill. She won't tell me how much she took out. She just keeps saying a little bit and that pisses me off because I am a numbers person. So you need to tell me what number I asked her how many CCs. Oh, just a little bit I'm like no seriously how many cc she's like oh I don't know I just took out a little bit just see how you do and I'm like that's bullshit like I just <laughs> so aggravating but anyway I don't know how I feel about this person that's taking over for me and um I'd rather not deal with that person I'd rather deal with the person that I've been dealing with but I can't throw a fit and cry about it so um we'll see what we can do um I did discuss with her that I'm considering the sleeve I'm considering it and I wanted her opinion and I knew that her opinion was not going to be an opinion it wasn't going to be anything except let's loosen your band let's see what we can do and let's change your diet a little bit which I am trying to do um I do not I cannot eat five times a day um unless you know, I'm like at work and stuff like that. I can manage to eat that many times a day. Um, so she pretty much told me that as long as I can get in three meals a day and hopefully five, just depending as long as I get, sorry, as long as I get all the protein that I need to get in, in those at least three meals. She doesn't want any less meals because sometimes I can only eat twice a day. Um, but I'm miserable um, all the time because I'm constantly stuck because I'm trying to eat fast or I'm always hungry. It's just, I'm always starving Marvin. Like, I don't like that feeling because I wasn't even like that when I was fatter without the band. <laughs> yes, I was fatter, believe it or not. Um, so yeah, pretty much, I just wanted to update you guys. I know 
some of you guys I still watch. I watch Jen and Brad. I love my ginger. I watch her videos. Um, I watch Danielle. Hey, booze. I love you all. And I do watch a few others that I come across sporadically while watching my team. I call them my team because they have been with me through thick and thin and we actually talk on a personal level and I wish I could see them all, but they're actually scattered all over the world. So that that's good for a tour. <laughs> but anyway, um, I just wanted to give an update. I am considering a revision. And of course, once I let the ball roll a little bit more, I will update you guys. Um, those that are interested in watching my lap band videos. So for the most part, nothing has changed except that I'm getting more and more aggravated because I'm not losing weight. Um, I'm active per usual, like at work and stuff like that. Um, meals wise, that's my issue. And I'm going to start taking more and more vitamins. So those are the changes that I'm going to make. And that's all I can do. I mean, there's nothing else. I do want to discuss it with her again about the sleeve. I, I want to kind of weigh out my options and see what it is and the only reason why I'm considering the sleeve is because I feel that my hunger pains and the hunger feeling is what's causing me to get stuck because I'm consistently hungry so I'm always picking at something to eat and I'm eating the wrong things and I'm getting stuck on the good things so it's it's I don't know it's causing a conflict with me so I'm gonna try this way out for a little bit I'm gonna go back to my roots per se and see how it works out for me with the band if I am still feeling the hunger and the pain like the hunger pains that I get and the uncomfort that I get and I'm constantly hungry like I hate that feeling I don't want to think of food all the time or just being hungry and getting some soup in or something I don't want to think about that all the time I don't want it to consume me and I drink like I, as far as liquids go, my water and my, my tea intake, it is like up there. Like I can get a hundred ounces of fluids in a day, with no problems. That's not a problem. The problem is that I'm still starving Marvin. So yeah, sorry that this video is lengthy and it probably doesn't make any sense to you guys, but I wanted just to put out an update up there, out there, <laughs> because I do watch my old videos and I know people do still come across those older videos and I look at them and I'm like, God, I was so motivated. What the hell happened? And life has happened. Um, I'm not in a good place. Uh, some of you guys know my, just like maybe a few of you guys know, my personal issues and stuff that I'm dealing with. So hopefully once that, you know, subsides and improves, I can improve on myself. So anyway, um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Um, I hope this update wasn't too rambly, but all my updates are so whatever anyway i wanted to give a shout out to jen and brad hello love you long time um danielle i love you little baby danielle <laughs> um and ginger i love you love you love you so much and thank you just just thank you you know you've done so much for me and i hate that you're so far away because i want to give you a booby hug and there's so many other people alicia i love you sis you're very, very supportive, and I know that um, I could do better in keeping in touch because I suck at that, but I'm in a really bad spot. So anyway, I'm wanting to be happy, so uh, let the Jesus juice begin. No. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.